Alright y'all, I just want to make a quick video on how you change out your uh, door latch here on a uh, freight line of Columbia. So you already got the new one up there. Uh, just to make it a little easier for y'all because I have to do a lot of figuring out. Sorry, it's a little noisy. I'm right next to a uh, busy road here. Actually right at Freightliner doing it in the parking lot. But anyway, um, first thing you want to do is there's a bunch of uh, these uh, torque heads you got to take out uh, here, 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 up there. Um, there's three right here. Uh, one, two, three. Then you're going to come over. He's going to have these black things here like this. You have to pry those out. And there's a little open where you can slip a screwdriver down in there. Just right, you feel around it, and you can pop it right out. So there's one. Sorry about that. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay? And you also got to come up here. And uh, as you know, the door panel, you have to take that one out there. And then there's two holding this here and behind that. Okay, and the last one that's the tricky one that it took me a while to figure out. You have to pop your mirror cover off. And then this one right here, it's holding my ground strap. It's probably the same, but this one here, you got to unscrew that. Okay. Uh, as for sizes for the torque set, this one here, this biggest one, that would be a T40, and these smaller ones, uh, give me one second, it's a T25, I believe. Okay, or whatever you work have that works for you, you know, if you can find an Allen key to fit in there, uh, you know, so be it. Definitely got to get something that's long enough to go in there, too. Uh, other than that, once you get that off, let's see, should be able to pop this back, okay, and then this here is going to be connected like this, okay, this is going to be in there like that, but it's going to be a side little hole there, okay, what you got to do, I did, I got a screwdriver, and grabs this out and slowly pried it back and forth so it popped out like that okay now the new one comes with the new green thing which is that one on there I already uh, took the old one off you can destroy it but make sure you got this green thing before you do that um, so yeah pry that out put the new one on uh, the door latch is pretty self explanatory there's another Four Torx heads. I think you got to take out these two main ones here. Hold on a second. Here. And then I think there's uh, two here, small ones that go in there. And then that's pretty much it. Yeah, so hopefully that helps you guys. Um, it took me a little longer than I'd like to, but now I'll know for next time. Hopefully that'll help you guys. Also, I forgot to mention, this little green thing, you want to slide that into the hole on this latch first before you put it on this rod. Um, or else you, it's not going to fit. I've been sitting here trying to mess with it, so don't make that mistake either. So this new green thing that comes with the latch, slide that into that hole there first. Uh, and then slide the rod in there and it clips right around it. Just like that.